Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a couple of weeks ago, I let you know that Flyby 11, which is a bypass tool to install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware, was now Fly OOBE. And as I mentioned in the video, the latest update to Flyby 11 had rebranded it to Fly OOBE with version 0.35 and the OOBE refers to out-of-box experience. I'll leave the video linked. Check it out if you'd like some more information. Now, just to let you know that the developer has now released Fly OOBE version 1.2, which is the latest release. So if we just head over to GitHub, where the app is maintained and developed, here we can see you've got links for both the classic Flyby 11 and the new Fly OOBE, which I think is a nice move. So you've got the option to get your hands on both Classic and the new version. And I'll leave this page in the description if you'd like to get your hands on these download links to try the app out. And the new version, version 1.2, has three new improvements and one announcement. And the first improvement is it's mentioned new OOBE windows for custom windows 11 installs and repairs currently rolled out in preview with support for mct which is the media creation tool and rufus which is another popular bypass app as you may well know but just take note though it is said that currently there is limited clr so no stable automation yet but the developer says they are considering whether to add a native solution similar to the very first Flyby 11 builds holding off until future releases. And it is stated that Fly OOBE now already covers the full spectrum, which means upgrades, clean installs, and the complete out-of-box experience. So this is quite a nice move if you are wanting to install Windows 11 on that unsupported hardware. And then just to mention the rest, the second improvement is it said that it's improved the ISO mounting, which now filters volumes to only those that actually have a drive letter. And there are minor performance optimizations and reduced RAM usage. Now, the announcement is basically a heads up where the developer says Flyby 11 and Fly OOBE will be merged into a single project in an upcoming release, along with further code cleanups and improvements. And obviously, when that happens, I'll let you guys know. And as I have mentioned previously on the channel, I personally don't recommend installing Windows on unsupported hardware, but this is quite a popular app and has gained quite a lot of popularity since it was first introduced a while back. And I know there are a lot of you who do run Windows 11 on unsupported hardware, so just trying to keep you guys in the loop like we like to do on the channel. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.